What's going on, family? Let's get into it. All right. If you guys, okay, if you guys like something complete, fully complete, I urge you guys to keep this one fully ready to go. That means if you get a prompt, it needs to be done. Okay. Without further ado, let me tell you guys, this does have three skins. I'm currently on the third one. You come in on two. Okay, so to change the skin, all you have to do is go into System, Settings, and Interface. And you'll see it there. It'll, it'll tell you what it is. Click on it. Take it to, just, 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 just go to each one and see which one you like best. Okay, this is all, this is all you need, man. Let me know how you guys like this one. Let's get straight into the video. Ladies and gentlemen, you know where you're at. This is your host with the most. How's everybody doing out there? If you're new here, welcome. Truly glad everybody st stopped by. Hoping everybody's keeping it safe. All right, all right. I had to do it. I had to do it, I know. I had to do it. I had to do it. We gonna get into it today. I, I don't know. I don't even know. I, I don't even know. First off, shout out to my man Diamond, man. Shout out to my dude. Um, haven't talked to him in a while. Hopefully everything's going okay. This one right here, man. Just for the record, too. Um, <laughs> the Michael Jordan joint was, it, it, it's just stock. I just, I just added some things. It, it, it wasn't, you know, a lot of people was like, yo, man, I need that. Like, it's just something I did. It wasn't nothing. Really, I don't know. Maybe I could zip it up. It wouldn't make any sense, though. I, I got people that would help me zip it up, but it, it wouldn't make any sense. You could do it yourself. I mean, if if all you wanted was was the Jordan in the background, I could I could clearly help you with that. You know, that's nothing. But um, it wasn't. It wasn't. <laughs> it was. It was a setup. <laughs> a simple setup. Okay, listen, I want to get into this one. Let's get into this. Um, whenever you guys get to a setup, I want you guys to give it a few ticks to load, okay? Now, and, and I want you guys to take this right here seriously. He's actually, I mean, for him to do this, I remember he used to do this back in the days. Like, he used to put little, you know, things up there for people. But this is pretty much like I, I don't know how you could get this one wrong. Okay. Um widgets here, I just hit them. Widgets here, I just hit them. Widgets here, I just hit them. Um I want this one to be kind of like a I want it to be a little bit different. Um Things are going on here. It's a lot of stuff going on here. Now, <clears throat> first of all, we already got our auto enable auto complete. He already has it done. Um, this is easily customizable if you guys are familiar with some things. Easily customizable. Nothing there. Um, kind of like this system in power. I kind of like how he did this. In total. Now, listen, with this right here, it works. Everything's working here. Okay? It's pretty much self explanatory. I don't really know how to go through this one because it's so self explanatory. If you want it, get it, got it, good. All right? Let's go through some things, though. 
it's almost like what else can I tell you guys, man? I, I don't know. Let's go to the add-on browser. The first thing, you know, I like to do is make sure everything's up and ready to go. You see everything's up and ready to go here. Now, what I like to do is go to the video player input stream and just make sure both of these are enabled. By, that, by now, if, if you guys are new and you don't really know what's going on or something, just let me know, man. I, I can gladly direct you. But, usually your input stream adaptive will be disabled. This one was actually enabled. And if yours comes in disabled, just enable it. Um, the RTMP input, you guys already know how to do that. And if you don't, let me know. Just go to install from repo or repos and go right back to video play input stream. Okay. Once you get back to um, video play input stream, just go to the RTMP input. Make sure you guys get it. It's simple as that. Now, with this particular thing right here, I would like everybody, and this is for everybody, Long press on this stuff, get the information on it. You have the information here at your fingertips. You can get it. You can see what it does. The power, the power. You can search anything, okay? Especially, come on, we got, we got, we got internet now. You can search anything. You can know what things do and know what they don't do. All right, um, covered that quickly. And I, I, I'm not trying to, you know, cover things quickly and things like that. It's just that, you know, a lot of my, a lot of things that I do on videos are repetitive. And, you know, sometimes it might get boring. I, I just, you know, it's all good. Um, let's go to settings. Okay. You can also get there to, to your add-ons from here, from settings. But he got the add-on browser in there. I don't know why you would do anything else. What I want to focus on here is player. Now, just for the just for future references, if you get to another setup, you want to have your level on expert. Okay? That's that's a fact. This is what you want to have it on. You want to have it on expert. My thing is here. Once you guys get a good mental picture on this, because this is how it's supposed to look. You see me do it on on, 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 on the MJ joint, it was just like this. But what I want to focus on is enable HQ scalers for scaling above. Now, this particular setup comes in on 60. You guys know I like mines on 100 for all the devices, 3 gigabytes and up. <laughs> for, all, yeah, for all the devices, 3 gigabytes and up. Currently on the shield right now, they have various other devices, <clears throat> larger, better than three gigabytes i fell into the hoopla the nvidia this and the nvidia that before i actually did my research they have very they have countless things out there better than this i feel like the nvidia shield is if you want to play games i don't play games on the nvidia shield i have went retro on it a couple of times but then i just bought the consoles okay um you guys want to check one out let me know i got you but I think it might might not need it, especially if you're on a budget, especially at this kind of time. You want to get you want to get the power, just not with you know. If you ain't playing games on the only thing you need to shield, but that's just my opinion. Now, two gigabyte devices, your Fire TVs, cubes, as well as your Nvidia tubes. Those are all two gigabyte devices, medium devices, in my opinion. I like to have that on 50 or 60. And for your small end devices like your fire sticks, etc., I like to have it on 20 or 30. Now, people, this is a real section. As you can see, it came in on 60. I did not change it. And if I, it, it, you know, it, if it's something wrong, you know, with me saying that it came in on 60, it, it, if I'm not being, you know, a buck with you, Diamond will say it. Okay? Um,. It all determines, this particular section, what, from what I have learned, it all determines on whether you're using Ethernet or Wi-Fi. Okay, real simple and plain. If you're using Wi-Fi, you might want to dial your settings down a little bit, from 60 probably to 40 or 50. 
if you dial it down to 40 and it's working good for a 2 gigabyte device, try to bump it up. See where it's at. But the problem is, and what you should be learning is what your device is actually capable of and what can it do. That's the reason why you get a device. Okay? You want to know what it do. You just don't want to put it on. That's stuff my lady do. She just puts it on and she expects it to do whatever it does. She cares not about what's going on in the background. Okay? So, always get used to checking this section, people. Now, with this particular setup, I'm telling you guys, this is packed. After everything, this is a big boy. 488 megabytes is ready to go. Okay? 488 megabytes is ready to go. It's everything here for you. One thing I want you guys to focus on after everything is done, you will have something here called Widget. It is your friend. Okay, check out the widget. Like he said here, okay, it will be under widget. So if you want the crew, you want, you know, things like that, whatever you like, it'll be there if you get it. It's nothing else for me to do, people here, but let's just go straight to the wizard. Now, once in the wizard, I always like to go to maintenance. Before I write my advanced settings, I just like to clean all. Once I get that to zero, I like to go to tools. And then I like to go to full config. Now, once I go to full config, this is what I'm telling you guys. If you're not familiar with this, just go on down to read buffer factor okay now you can keep it here I recommend bumping it up to 10 and after read buffer factor I recommend going right to buffer mode and putting it on 1 it comes on 2 by stock read buffer factor comes on 5 by stock okay whatever you should choose to do with these last two just don't forget to write the file that's that's really about it okay and then once you're done with that, just go ahead and restart your setup. Simple and plain. Once you guys restart your setup, you should have a very good experience. Okay. Now, I told you guys I wouldn't take too many ticks. I'm not taking too many ticks. Um, I want to thank everybody for stopping by. If you get a chance, like, share, and subscribe. But most of all, comment. Don't forget to hit the notification bells, people. As always, I'm hoping you're having a blessed, peaceful, and a productive day. Love and peace for all. Never forget, it is good to be good, and it is bad to be bad. I want everybody to stay safe out there, y'all. And let's try to love each other just a little bit more. See you guys on the next one, y'all. Peace.